My first introduction, and I don't remember exactly how it happened, but I ended up um, auditioning. I was in choir at Muir, and I had never made it into like the top choir at John Muir. And I remember I auditioned for the choirs here, and um, I made it into chamber my first my, my freshman year, and I was like, wow, okay. And um, you know, I was supposed to go to Burbank High, and the reason I ended up coming to Burroughs was to be in choir. We went to we had a rehearsal here, and I was just like, wow, this is this is going to be fun. Well, I was a sophomore. This was before they had freshmen at Burroughs, and I was a sophomore. I had been at another school out of the district f just for about nine months, and I missed auditions. So I came in, and I saw that there was choir, and I came in and asked Mary if I could audition, and she had me audition on the spot, which was so nerve-wracking because I was terrified to sing in public. Um, I probably came to a Burroughs VMA show, I think when I was in seventh grade. Um, I went to middle school across town and my, uh, the teacher there, you know, had said good things about the Burroughs program. So I came and saw a show and I think I was instantly grabbed by the quality of it. And a few short years later, I was at Burroughs and as a student, and then I never left. Uh, I was at Luther, in the choir at Luther, and actually, no, the first time I saw it, I uh, was at Bret Hart, and uh, I was in sixth grade, and they, the, the choir came and performed, it was chamber choir, and uh, I, in that moment, of course, they were in like the, those blue spandex costumes that weren't very pretty. But in that moment, those were the prettiest costumes I had ever seen in my entire life and the most beautiful people I had ever seen. And I was like, I have to do that. I have to be in choir. I have to be on stage. And so that was in sixth grade. My first introduction was eighth grade. I had no idea what show choir was. I had no idea what Burroughs was at all. And I came in at spring concert to perform, and I had already auditioned, and I saw everything, and I was like, you know, this this is what I want to do, this. And what's interesting is that I almost didn't go to Burroughs at all, and after seeing spring concert, changed my mind, and I had to go to Burroughs and be in choir. I was in the seventh grade, and I had just come to a pop show because my sister was at Burroughs, and I... First, first act I ever saw or remember actually was Don't Tell Mama and it was amazing as a seventh grader young boy but it was so much fun just to see this amazing program back then and everything and see all the things that they do and the acts and the dancing and the singing it was so eye-opening for me as a seventh grader it's amazing I think what makes it unique is that it's a big, huge family, and it's, it's like unconditional love, basically. You know, you could screw up in time and everyone's still, it's okay, <laughs> come into the pot and we'll hug you. Um, I think what makes this program unique is that we have a staff full of alumni. A, a staff of people who have been in this program and who, to whom it has meant something very special. And we are so dedicated to preserving that for future choir kids that it's just, it's like we are absolutely 100% committed to them having the same amazing experience, if not better, than what we had. It's a whole bunch of people who really love working with kids. It's a whole bunch of people who love art in general and love making art together and with kids and get along and we kind of just like pick up people along the way and it's kind of like this huge snowball effect and it just keeps getting bigger and bigger and bigger and the love keeps getting bigger and bigger and bigger along with it and so it's just like a huge family of love and you know we have 180 kids to give that love to. I think what makes the Burroughs program so special um, is that there's a community of people around the program that support it and love it and would do anything for it. Whether it's alumni or 
parents of alumni or just community members who've never had anybody in the program, but they, they always come to the shows. Um, it's, it's this legacy that's gone on for so many years and has touched so many people's lives that those people are inspired to come back and give, whether it's time or money or whatever, to, to keep the program building and growing. And it's just this really phenomenal opportunity for high school kids in a public school that you just you don't see anywhere else. It's just something you never forget. It's something you, you never want to forget. It was, this was my life during high school. This is, you know, the memories I have in high school consist of, you know, 90% of, of choir. I just know that Burroughs puts on a pretty good production. <laughs>